Hello everybody, welcome back to Adventures in Rod Building. Uh, this is the second part of the flag weave. Uh, you see that uh, down below I have the, the first one if you haven't seen that yet. So in this one here I am uh, completing the wrap and then starting to tie it off. And then at the end you'll see it completed. So in the background here you'll see the, the thread list uh, that I did. Um, if you have any questions let me know about it. And uh, thanks for watching. So for this part here, you see I'm, I'm pulling on the different threads, uh, trying to make it a little bit tighter than what it was. Um, it was it started popping up and it wasn't flush with the blank. Um, trying to get that as best as I could. Um, it was a little struggle, but I, I got it a little bit better than it originally was. Right, so then here I'm, I'm dealing with some, some threads that were overlapping and it was causing an issue with the, the different stripes. So um, pulling those and trying to get them tight a little bit also kind of helped. So there's that. All right, so here I'm adding some color preserver to help uh, stabilize the, the stripes. Um, this way I'm able to uh, finish the wrap and um, add, the, add the end wraps to it.
here I'm I'm starting the end wrap of the of the flag. Uh, this is where I terminate the end of the the flag to make it a little a little more presentable. Um, you'll see that all the extra thread has been uh, cut off. I did that previously here. Um, so. All right, so that's the that's the end of this video. Um, hopefully you learned something from it. I certainly did. This was, um, I thought it was gonna be easy wrap, but it turned out to be more difficult than a, than a cross wrap. So, um, uh, let's see, see what you guys think about that. So, um, I'm finally gonna get back to my fly rod rebuild. And I think on that, I'm gonna try a, uh, a fish scale wrap. I have no idea how that's going to go, so um, stay tuned for that. So hopefully I'll have something up for that in a little bit. Um, I have to actually rebuild the, the fly rod first, so that's going to happen, and then I'll have videos out on, on that process. So um, thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe and like.